Hi everyone! Hi everyone! Thanks for joining us for today's Cross with Grace. Guess what? Hmm. We have a special treat for our viewers today. We are going to be doing a special 4th of July craft before the holiday. Um, what are we going to be doing today? Patriotic Fourth of July wood socks that Maybe you can whisper in your ear. Oh, <laughs> that we can use for decoration, right? Yeah. yeah. So we could decorate our house. All right. Cool. Well, this fun and easy craft should only take a few minutes today. Um, can you let our viewers know what they need to start the craft? Stars. Yeah. First. Okay, you know what? I'll take over. <laughs> Champagne first time. Oh, there she is. So we have a template on the center website that you can print out these stars. Um, you can print out a couple depending on how many you want to use for your wood sock. So you're gonna need that template, or you can print your own stars, or if you have stamps that are stars, awesome. And you're going to need staple. We're going to need a stapler with staples. Blue. Instructions like that. <laughs> and. Lay on the pillows. And. Lay on the pillows. Red and white crepe paper streamers. And tape, scissors festive ribbon if you have it or twine or uh, just regular ribbon works too to hang your wings off. We're also going to need some glue. We're also going to need a hole punch and I think that's it. Should we get started? Cotton ball shoe. <laughs> Should we get started? Okay here we go. So first step is to cut out all of your stars. Because after that, after the first step, the next step is to glue your stars on your blue construction paper. All right. Grace, do you want to cut stars? Um, no. They're too hard. <laughs> okay. Mommy can definitely help cut stars for you. How's that sound? Okay. Okay. Deal. Step is to glue your stars all over your blue construction paper wherever you want. Once you've glued your stars, we're going to give it just a few minutes to dry before we roll it up into a wind sock and put on the crepe paper. Right to dry, right? Yep. Yeah. Not bad. Didn't take too long. Okay, so the next step that we're going to do is we're going to flip our construction paper on its on the front side so the back side's facing up and then we are going to line up the crepe paper and alternate the colors all the way through um, to add the wind sock part. Ready to do it? Yeah. Once you have all your crepe paper taped at the bottom then what we're gonna do is we are just gonna roll it like so and then you're going to take your stapler ask your mom and dad to probably help just in case and staple both ends right Gracie mm -hmm. and there you have your fourth of july wind sock now the last part of it um, we are going to add, uh, we are going to add a ribbon so we can hang it. So you just want to hole punch each side, kind of towards the top. With a hole pencil. With a hole puncher. And then you could take your twine, your ribbon. Um, and then cut it with scissors or scissors. Yes, we're going to cut it with scissors. And then you just thread it through and tie, thread it through the hole. And then you're just gonna tie a knot, kind of much like, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
down just like that. And then I like to do two knots, same thing. Um, if the wind's extra windy, this will hold up outside. Right, Grace? Yeah. Because that's why they don't hurt other people because it, they put it up at wind. <laughs> I mean, not, not one time. Correct. Okay, so there's one side, and then we are just going to pull it, and then make sure you have enough room to hang. So okay. we're going to go that height, and then Grace is going to cut it, go a little bit further. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. You're almost there. Good job. I know, ribbon's sometimes tricky. Good job. And then you're going to do the same on this end. And thread it through. Right, Grace? This was fast. This one was a really fast cast, huh? Um, it's time to say goodbye. Almost. Yeah. One, one more knot away. That's why I said it's time to say goodbye. Almost. Almost. So. All right. Goodbye, everybody. So now you have your awesome Fourth of July socks. Sure, that. you can. Um, just a couple messages. Grace and I will also be teaching a Fourth of July special uh, craft activity where you will be creating uh, Lady Liberty crowns and uh, Uncle Sam mask uh, for the Fourth of July on Fourth of July at our usual time at three o'clock. The windsock was for today, our special today. Um. So make sure to tune in on the 4th of July to the Center's... Bye! <laughs> She's so excited to say bye today. On the Center's Facebook page where we will be posting the video on 4th of July. Um, or you can tune in at 3 o'clock if you have Cox uh, Cable. You can tune in to Channel 19 or uh, AT&T U-verse on Channel well, 99. Well, when we put music on, you'll still hear us. <laughs> that could have been really bad, dude. That's why we should sit down on chairs. Safety first. All right, thanks again for joining us, and we hope you join us on the 4th of July. Bye. Bye, everyone. And the vlog. End it. End it. Oh, you end the vlog. Thank you. <laughs> Bye, everyone. <laughs>